things. Hindi po ibig sabihin yan na pwede kang kumuha kahit saan na gusto. Pwede rin mo dito, pwede na siyang maging pop. Around Sagada, we have to scout for a good place to get a drink na hindi kami nakakasira sa environment at walang magagalit sa amin. Whenever we see one that is good, we haul that clay, bring them here, soak them in water for a few weeks. Sasalain namin ng dalawang beses hanggang makuha namin ang consistency of fineness sa katulad nito. After sieving two times, it's very very watery. We have to drip dry for three to four months. We age it for at least three weeks before na pwede namin siyang gamitin. May tatlong klase po ang pottery. May earthenware, stoneware, at saka porcelain. Earthenware, sir, low-fired. Ang best example po nito is yung ginagawa nila sa vegan, yung mga paso, yung mga lituan po. Ang ginagawa naman namin dito ay stoneware. Ang stoneware at saka porcelain, mataas ang luto nilang dalawa. Mayroon rich ang temperature na 2,350 degrees Fahrenheit. Now, I'm going to show you the making of the pot with a demo fee of 600 for the whole group. At kung may gusto mag-try, 100 per head. Okay po ba sa ating lahat? Okay. 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 So first of all, I'm going to center the clay. I'm centering the clay with pressure na nagagaling sa dalawang kamay ko and I have to go with the speed of the wheel. Before we can make any kind of shape that we want, may it be a bus, a bowl, or a mug, we have to do the cylinder first for that's the basic shape. To do the cylinder, bubutasan natin dito sa gitna. Palalawakin natin yan by pulling the clay towards the side. Dito naman po with controlled pressure from my bowl hands, I'm going to compress the clay together. And then dahan-dahan ko siyang iakiyat sa taas. One more time. So, kailangan po ang kamay ko po ang magko-control sa clay. Hindi po ang clay ang nagko-control sa kamay. At kailangan din kapag inaangat natin to, di na dahan-dahan natin. Hindi natin siya binibigla para hindi siya ma-off center at hindi mag-collapse. So, this is our cylinder. This can be a pot already, but we are going to reshape this for us to see how far the clay goes. So, ang gagawin ko, dito sa pinakailalim, I'm going to push it outward slowly while pushing. I'm pulling my hands up. Sinusuportahan ko po ang left hand ko with my right hand outside. Dito naman po sa gitna, tinutulak ko siya pa loob. Dahan-dahan din ako umaakyat. And then, itulak ko siya palabas at the very, very top para makagawa tayo ng flower vase. Ito, pwede pa po natin siya. Pansin ko lang yung tubig sa loob. Paseksihin ng konti. By pushing and pulling the clay up to the top. <coughs> At kung gusto naman natin itong maging water container, lalagyan lang po natin ng muso na ganyan. So, ang ginagawa namin dito, ini-air dry namin siya for 5 days. After 5 days of air drying, kapag leather dry na po siya, babalikan namin siya, trim namin ang bottom niya, lalagyan namin ang handle niya. Doon din ang time na maglagay kami ng any kind of decorations na gusto namin to enhance the beauty. Then, we air dry it again for a month. Iluluto namin sa oven for 12 hours of firing. Maghintay kami ng 2 days for the oven to cool down. We come back, bring out the pieces. Then, a-apply na namin siya ng glazes. Yung glazes po yung po nagbibigay kulay at kintaw sa kanya. Pero hindi po siya kagaya ng pintura na binahid mo lang matikita na agad ang result. Kailangan po siyang iluto ulit for another 15 to 18 hours bago lalabas ang kagandahan ng each piece. They are very good for food containers, they are microwavable, and of course, the color doesn't fade. Sino po ngayon ang gusto mag-try? Jo! May mga nasaw na po. Yung principal. Oh, principal! Oh my good. For our project. 
Ini kalau sup pagka ganyan mami pares ah ramen oh tama tama nagoya ramen Sabaw. <laughs> Tinolang sabaw. Wow, wow. Wow. Congratulations. Okay, next. Okay. 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 Okay.